Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Indian School of Physics. Guys, this is Nitin here and today I have come up with a problem for J mains specifically. It is uh, from communication systems. In uh, recently conducted uh, AITS, I have given this problem and uh, many students made mistake in this uh, problem though it was a very easy problem. So I thought I'll just take this problem and I'll discuss it and you can realize how easy this problem is and uh, you can join this uh, all india test series for j means uh, 2022 at an academy and it is completely free of cost anyone can join the uh, and there will be a series of five tests which i'll be making and you can uh, join this test series for free its link will be given in the description and you can use my code nitin sir uh, so here is the problem statement and it was uh, problem number uh, 19 <clears throat> so you can see here figure shows a communication system what is the output power when input signal of 1.1 1.01 milliwatts is uh, given to the system okay and uh, here it is given gain in decibels uh, and that is 10 log uh, base 10 p out by p in so output power we have to calculate here so we have to figure out uh, how much is the gain and then we can uh, calculate the output power so you can see here uh, there is this uh, amplifier and it is given if any input signal of uh, let's say intensity i or power p is given then the loudness wise it will amplify the signal by 10 decibel and then uh, the another amplifier is placed 5 kilometer apart and uh, due to the medium the losses are 2 decibels uh, per kilometer and then this amplifier will amplify the signal by 20 decibels and we will be getting an output all right so let's uh, use this data here let's say i'm using pi as input power all right or uh, in decibels, uh, let's take this is uh, di. I'm calling it. Okay, so after passing through this, uh, this di will become di plus ten. Then uh, five kilometer will travel, and there will be loss of two decibels per kilometer. So again, you can see whatever was the gain from amplifier one, that will get nullified by this part, right? And again, this signal will be here. Uh, you can say this will be. Uh, di and it will amplify it by 20 decibels and finally we are going to get uh, d out all right so this will amplify by 20 decibels so overall for this entire system you can say net amplification is 20 so let's uh, solve this question now uh, the path length is given and loss rate is given so loss uh, is 10 decibel just now i have explained and uh, the gain from both the amplifiers you can say first is given 10 decibel and another one is given 20 decibel so total gain is 30 so overall gain we can say the total gain minus loss this is what we were getting that di plus 10 it will become after passing through minus 10 uh, because of loss and finally again plus 20 will come so you can say net gain of 20 is there so in the in the problem this uh, formula is given the gain in decibel is 10 log 10 p naught by p out by p input so i'll just substitute here this 20 decibel is equal to 10 log 10 p out and pi value we know so you can say this p p out it will become uh, 10 is square it will become because this is this will become like uh, 2 so base 10 is given so 10 is square so you can say here this uh, p naught or p out it will become 100 times power input and power input value is uh, given to us so uh, that was given as 1.01 milliwatts so 101 milliwatt this will be the output and this is going to be the answer for this question and uh, which is option c so i hope guys you have understood this how easy this problem was uh, but trust me uh, i saw so many students have made a mistake in this uh, kind of problem and uh, such problems can definitely come in j mains and much more complex problems they have given in the past so i hope you have enjoyed this video and uh, you have learned something out of this video and uh, 
guys there is this uh, offer going on which is uh, <coughs> valid till march 21st to 23rd you can say and uh, in a three month subscription you'll be getting one month extension and for 12 months you'll be getting four months extension and uh, 12 months of uh, cbsc boards also you can uh, access and for 24 months again four months extension uh, you will get and 24 months of cbsc class 11th uh, you'll be getting all right so you can use my code in order to subscribe it so that's it guys in this video and i'll be including more uh, problems from that paper uh, because most of the students have found it uh, quite challenging so i'll be including those problems uh, very soon in the upcoming videos so thank you thanks for watching it